Yo, what's going on guys? So in this video, I'm going to share with you a secret high risk reward ICT trading strategy. It's one of my personal favorites. It's helped me get four or five figure withdrawals and actually helped me get funded numerous times. It's actually helped many others as well. So in this video, I'm going to walk you through step by step the simple rule based mechanical system, which if you guys can follow the rules to that I'm about to share with you with live examples for free, you will start to see yourselves pass these platform challenges and start hitting those four or five figure withdrawals with ease okay so without further ado let's get straight into the video so the main pairs for this system are going to be the usual gu and eu um on this example i'm going to go ahead and use eu we're going to be utilizing the 15 minute time frame the five minute time frame and the one minute time frame and the time frame we're actually going to be using is going to be 2 45 a.m to 4 a.m for new york traders or in a new york um session and uh, new york um yeah traders and then it's going to be basically 7 45 to 9 a.m uk time that's basically 15 minutes before the london open so, whether, so wherever you are, it's 15 minutes before the London Open. This is known as the London Kill Zone strategy, where we're going to be utilizing the Asian highs and lows. So very simply, we're going to look for a liquidity sweep on the 15 minute, as usual, um, of the Asian highs or lows. Once we've seen that, we want to see that liquidity sweep tap into an area of supply or demand. Right? This can be a fair value gap. This can be an order block, whatever it is. Right? As long as it's an area of supply and demand, that's ideal. Then we're going to simply scale down to the five minute time frame after it's tapped into this area of uh, supply or demand and hopefully look for an engulfing candlestick on the five minute time frame from that area of supply or demand in the opposite direction. OK, then we're simply going to scale down to the one minute time frame uh, and, 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 and identify a structure shift and um, then target an FVG on order block to base our entry off. So the diagram will look something like this, which I've drawn out for you right here. This signifies the Asian range. OK, this is the low. This is the high. In the scenario, we actually swept the high, tapped into an area of um, supply or demand on the left. Once the market's tapped into that, we want to wait for that sharp five minute engulfing, high probability engulfing from that area just to indicate, you know, the momentum shift. And this is a price action signal that I've actually implemented into my SMC style, which has helped me get amazing, amazing results. OK, then from that area, we're going to look for that one minute structure shift and then go ahead and actually use the fat, uh, the FVG or the order block to base our entry off. So we won't be entering with a massive stop loss up here. What we'll be doing is refining it to a specific area and getting a really high risk reward targeting the opposite end of the Asian range. So I hope that um, simplifies everything for you. Let's get straight into the charts. So before I get to the charts, guys, if you want to have your prop firm challenge passed or you want me to pass your challenge with 100% guarantee, then make sure you click the link below. Join the Telegram link in the description to secure yourself a spot. There are limited seats available for each challenge intake. Most people actually waste around six to $8,000 over three months before they reach their first funded account. But you guys can actually avoid this by using our service. Our bot actually has a 100% pass rate and it's never ever failed a single challenge for any of our clients. We will refund you all your costs if we don't pass. But like I said, we've never actually failed a single challenge for any of our clients. All the testimonials, all the proof is in this uh, Telegram link below. So secure yourself a spot for a small one-time price and go ahead and get yourselves onto the funded stage within a few days, hands-free, right? No stress. No wasting money, no wasting time. 100% guarantee you've heard it from myself. Uh, and as you guys can see here, I've actually received my fourth payout with this firm just a couple of days ago. So go ahead and get in while you still can. So guys, let's get straight into the example. Let me just remove this out of the way. So as you can see right here, I have actually forwarded the chart to, this is only just like a couple of days ago. Uh, sorry, yeah, Monday. So today's Wednesday for me. Um, so 10th of July, as you can see right here, what we've done is we've highlighted the Asian range. And if you guys want to know the session indicator for this, it's just called Asian highs, lows, midlines, right? So simply with this, you can see that I've highlighted the Asian range. We've actually stepped to the downside. And if we look to the left, we've actually tapped into a major area of, not a major area, but we've tapped into some area of major uh, demand, okay? Now that we've done this, we're simply going to go ahead and scale down to the five minute time frame. So what I could do over here, to be honest, is just go to the five minute time frame if it loads and understand that this is an area of uh, demand right here. So what I'm going to do is just highlight this area of demand. It's actually an order block. And now that we've tapped into this area, have we got a five minute engulfing? Well, it's not a high probability one, but still, regardless, this is a strong engulfing candlestick uh, from this area. Uh, sorry, a rejection candlestick. So what I'm going to look for now is a full engulfing candle. So that's not an engulfing candle in the opposite direction. It's actually just a weak rejection candle. And this one looks like, yeah, no, not that one. That's still not an engulfing there. Okay, great. So now that's an engulfing candlestick that we've received from this area. This is my own personal price action twist that I'm actually putting on this system because I've seen amazing results come from it, right? Instead of just entering randomly from this area, we're going to be waiting for a little bit of those price action signals. You might class it as retail, but it works, guys, regardless. It's amazing. So you can see right here, we've had an engulfing candlestick right here. This signifies to me that there's been a potential shift in momentum. Then I'm going to scale down to the one minute time frame very simply and then go ahead and look 
or my structure shift. Now, as we can see, the markets come down in a downtrending format from high, low, lower, high, lower, low. Then this market's made a lower high right here and then failed to make a new lower low. Since it's now done this, you can see that the momentum has shifted to the upside and actually broken beyond this previous high, creating a new higher high, right? Since the market's now done that, I can understand that the market has now shifted in a direction. And now what I'm simply going to, going to be doing is targeting the cheapest or the most extreme um, fair value gap for me to target my uh, entry off. So you can see right here, this would be in that case, the area of displacement, which I'm now going to go ahead and look for an entry in. And specifically, guys, we're going to be looking for an entry after 7.45, right? We're not going to be trading before 7.45. We're going to be trading at 7.45 onwards. So as we see the market here, what the time is here, 7.30. So let's just forward the chart. You can see we've tapped into this area, but I'm not going to be entering just right now. I'm going to wait for the market to come back into my area. And there we have it. So this is actually at 7.41, um, 7.42, 7.43, 7.44. So this right here would be 743, 744 close. And you could go ahead and now enter straight from this next candle because this would be the open of the 744 and the close of the 745. So you can go ahead and enter there. But for a more refined entry, the best thing to be doing would be to wait for the market to come back in. So as soon as it's tapped into here, I would go ahead and look to enter. And actually put my stop loss not below the FPG. I would like to put it below this first candle, which caused the displacement. And to help you guys understand that, you have one candle right here. So you have... The first candle, the displacement candle, and the third candle, we want to put our stop loss below this low right here. Okay, now that we've gone ahead and made our stop loss below this low, what we're simply going to be doing, like I said, in the rule based system, is we're going to be targeting the previous Asian high, right? Because the, the low's been taken out, so now we're going to go ahead and target the previous high. So let's see how this trade plays out. Beautiful reaction, as you can see right there. And now, as you can see, this is around the eight o'clock mark with that London liquidity. Um, and London volatility coming in. Let's see how this trade plays out. Great price action. And there you guys have it. So take profit hit right there. And the rule based system just following through with it and giving us that delivery of price in a very, very nice format. So let's just forward it over to the next day and show you guys how this example carried out. I think it was just yesterday, in fact, um, because I did see this live definitely. So let's just forward it over. Okay. So as you can see here, I've already marked out a little area for you guys as an example. That's worked out for me just literally yesterday. So let me just get rid of all this for now so you guys can see. Let me do it in real time. So what we have here, don't need to mean to, to mix that. So what we can see right here is the Asian box, right? So we have the Asian highs and the Asian lows. We can see the market trending and let it just break out. So now the Asian uh, session's finished. We want to wait for a sweep of these highs or these lows. Then we've had a sweep to the high. And we can actually see that on the left hand side, just to save you guys um, the time of me finding it. You can see that we've actually tapped into an area of supply, I believe. Let's keep scrolling. You will see it soon. Right. As you can see right here, I've already marked out an area for you guys that occurred yesterday. An area of supply that the market's tapped into. If we just go reset the chart, you can see that the market has tapped into that very, very nicely. And if we go down to the five minute time frame right now, as our rule states, we want to see some sort of an engulfing from this area okay so this happened just yesterday uh, and even happened the day before that so i want to keep showing you guys you know live examples like this um so you guys can see so right now i'm not seeing any engulfing i don't want to enter there we have a pretty good that's it perfect so now we've had a nice market structure shift not really market structure shift a, sh a structure sh a, sh a shift in momentum with the um price action right here so a five minute momentum shift is what i'm going to call it um it doesn't have to take out price action you know a previous market structure but if we go to the one minute time frame you can see yourself that it's actually managed to take out structure so it is in a way a structure shift um but it's mainly a momentum shift from what i can see so with that being said right now i'm going to go over to the one minute time frame and i'm going to start to look for my areas of um displacement to go ahead and look for an entry and the most extreme one i can find right here is this gap right there okay and this happened at 7 30 and now we're going to be waiting for 7 45 to kick in and go ahead and enter off so let's see what time this is right now 7 42 7 45 so i'm still not entering but i'm going to wait for the market to tap into my area right now ideally since it's now beyond 7 45 so as you can see the market's trending still not going into our area and there we have it now that the market's tapped into our area of displacement we're going to go ahead and enter right here put our stop loss above this um previous high right here okay we're not actually going to go ahead and start putting it above the whole area of supply we're going to maximize our risk to reward by making our stop loss smaller 
okay and don't forget you guys can always split your positions up into numerous parts to go ahead and make sure you don't get slipped you know the spreads don't do anything to you just go ahead and start splitting your positions up into different parts so as you can see right here we're going to go and go ahead and follow our rules just uh, as usual and target this previous low uh, on the asian um, end so we're going to look target the asian lows because we've seen the asian highs get taken out very very simple and this is going to help us potentially get a one to eight risk reward but before i go ahead and play this um trade out if you guys want to be part of my uh, inner circle for a one-time payment to get lifetime access to my full course where i'm going to go through all my strategies in depth and actually give you guys the full breakdown on how i actually go about using them with all my um, webinars pre-recorded webinars pre-market webinars sunday breakdowns and also post trade analysis breakdown as well as the discord community with share trade ideas and 24 7 support um you guys can actually go ahead and join my academy for a small one-time price the price will definitely be going up really soon um and i'll probably be closing enrollment as well in the next coming weeks okay you guys can see from the website right here every one of my web uh, webinars that i upload do get straight uh, displayed onto my website here so you guys can see what we're doing right july 3rd market outlook and a new content update market outlook you guys can see over here a uh, gold trade breakdown so every time i take a trade i usually go and give a breakdown for you guys right over here so go ahead click the link below and make sure you guys join the academy so let's get straight back into the trade as you can see right here the market's tapped into our area of supply and as you can see beautiful reaction from here and like i said guys it's a pretty high win rate with this system um it's one of my personal personal favorites um i really like the system very very simple uh, and rule based so honestly guys if you want to start getting your funding challenges passed or you want to start getting these high uh, five figure withdrawals this is a beautiful system i mean you guys can get funded using our service go ahead and put on one percent risk over here or half a percent even and that's a one to eight that's four percent risk a four percent gain even on half um, a percent risk right so it's a very very simple system you guys can see the system playing out time and time again i'm not going to be unrealistic and target you know and say oh we can catch all of this but you guys could use it if you just trail your stop losses but we're going to stick to our rules and go ahead and target these asian lows like we previously said so that's pretty much it guys i don't want to go ahead and make this video too long hope you guys found this video helpful like i said all the links will be in the description down below if you guys want to have any if you guys have any questions or you want to um, just follow me on socials and see some of my content educational content like i've got here everything is at sniper ads um so yeah go ahead and drop that a follow will be highly appreciated drop a like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in the next one peace